Hi everyone, my name is Jared Beeman and I'm an application specialist in our concrete segment for Tecla Structures. In this video we'll be discussing the new functionalities of our CMU tools that include bond beams, horizontal and vertical reinforcement, and we've also added drawings, quantity reports, and other templates that are available out of the box with the download. For a quick overview, to place the wall, we'll select two points to identify the length. For all the other parameters of the blocks and the reinforcement, we'll open up the dialog to make those adjustments. If we double click on our wall, that'll pull up all of the parameters. There's where we can define the wall height and what type of block we're using. We can select if we want end blocks. And here's an example of specifying our bond beam rows. These are the three tabs we've added to specify the bond beams, the vertical rebar, and the bond beam reinforcement. Out of the box, we've added several different sizes from 12 inch units down to four inch units. We've also added several common shapes. And don't forget, you can also add your own custom blocks into our tool. We've also added quantity reports with the download. Using the organizer, we can develop quantity reports that we can export to Excel. In this example, I've set up two categories in the organizer, rebar and masonry. To develop a report, we click on the category and you can see the information filled in on the left. We've added several GA drawing settings out of the box. These settings can colorize our drawing views based on the block type. We've added quantity schedules onto our sheet that will give a total quantity of the different block types. There's also a setting that can add a unique identifier to the blocks. And we can also create rebar placement drawings. If we need to add a mark to these reinforcement, we'll select them and add those. And then we can merge those individual marks to get a total quantity of all of the rebar. Here's an example of how we can use Trimble Connect with our masonry model. We can export our model to Trimble Connect using the connector, and this will allow non techly users to look at our model. Trimble Connect can be used on mobile devices, your desktop, and on the web. You can move and rotate around the model easily. You can zoom in to look at detail closely. If you want to gather information about these objects, you can click on them and click on the information icon on the bottom left. This will include all the information exported from Tecla Structures. In this example, I clicked on several objects to gather information. Use status sharing to give a live update to all Trimble Connect users. You can create your own status to say that it started, paused, or completed, and this will also be linked to the Tecla model. That concludes the content for this presentation. Don't forget to go to the warehouse to download the tools. And here's a link for other tips and techniques for concrete, and to contact us if you have any video requests or would like a demonstration.